手置きを見せてやる All right, so in this one, we are going to be using Ultra Kaioken Goku. I、uh, haven't used him recently, and I am curious to see how he can do. I've been seeing him run around actually more PvP with, I mean, not really a resurgence of purples, but with a、uh, more vast array of units just being run because this season is kind of dry. People just want to run random shit, so I don't blame them. And、uh, if you are wondering, this is just a random robe I found. I, yeah, it's very comfy, so here we are. Uh, gonna be running him here though. Again, wanna see what he can do. He is the only Ultra in the entire game, actually. I don't have 14 stars because I didn't particularly care for him. I pulled him very quickly when he first released. Then took me about 30k to pull about two more copies. So he has good, good rates for me. But again,、uh, this guy is probably the biggest fall off a cliff Sunbolt Ultra. While there is only three Sunbolt Ultras,、uh, he's the biggest fall off a cliff because you have Gogeta, who is. Arguably top three. You have Vegito, who is arguably number one, number two, whatever. He's top three, right? And then you have Kyle Ken, who's, in my opinion, not even top 10.、Um, I would say he's top 20, but top 15, I think, is reserved for other units to where they barely don't make top 10. Similar to, like, I don't even know. Who, who would even be there? Maybe, like, if you don't say Angel Golden Freeze is top 10, he'd be top 15, something like that kind of vibe. Or Whis, maybe you could say drops down because while Whis is still valuable with red, red, purple, Whis has dropped in value. Not to say he's not top you know, 20, but he has dropped in value from being probably a top 10 unit prior to a、uh, counter out unit of Ultra Gogeta getting a partner with Ultra Vegito. But gonna run him here in God Key.、Uh, the main issue with this Kaioken is that his teams don't really care for him. Uh, you know, if he had support with some output of that support, you know, this green Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta, for example, well, he would be thriving a lot more. But the thing is that Vegeta is more strike based and he flows on better teams than with Kaioken, so it just makes him inferior to an option. And then you run Whis, and it's like, well, Whis is just a 2v3. You're getting two cards with Whis, and then you're dying, and well, you're hoping for the best with your other units. And while you can't have that with like MUI and droids, Kaioken isn't MUI and droids. He can't do what they do. Maybe he can in a longer game. But、uh, the game is so quick now. If you just fuck up one time, you're losing a unit. I mean, it's even more like power craft in that manner just because how Vegito works, how Gogeta works, how lock ins work, how sub counts work. Like, it, it, you lose anything, and then you're just in such a back foot. It is not impossible, but it's nearly impossible to come back. But again, gotta run him here on God Key USS. You leader him. Great. Awesome. Who's your green unit? Angel Golden Freeza. Well, he's not getting support from that team. He needs support. He doesn't hit hard enough, even at 10 stars or at 14 stars. He needs support. So I have to gas him here with the Wii support, with Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta support. Also, Wii support gives you a green card because Wii holds a green card. So it'll all work out. Not gonna Zenkai buff him. I actually do want to see what he can do on his own. Obviously, I could run God Vegeta there, Strike Tag, and even Zenkai buff、uh, for God Key, and then obviously Zenkai buff God、uh, Super Saiyan Blue Kai Ken Goku. But I want to see what he could do raw with. It's not even raw. Raw with double support, right? Team wise, we do have Goku Vegeta, who is double attack, and I lose strike defense、uh, for Vegeta Clan, Sun Family, or movies.、Uh, God Topo is double attack, I do believe, right? I was trying to build double attack because Vegeta is more strike based, Kyle Kent is more blast based, so kind of go in that realm.、Uh, God Goku is giving HP and critical to us there. Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta, Zenkai buffing nobody with strike attack and defense. Whis, I believe, is double defense. Then Kyle Ken is also. Uh, weirdly, as a blast based unit, he's double defense on Z ability.、Um, I don't really understand that. I think he's, what is he, 3% spells remove arts damage inflicted on his、uh, Z ability here for, yeah, 3%. Again, God Key is weird because he's, or not God Key, double defense is weird because he's blast based, but Legends doesn't really know what it's doing a lot of time.、Uh, just to go over him, I guess in a stat spread manner, again, his stats are fine, it's just that. His output doesn't do enough. He, I hate to say this, he feels like a unit that was carried by Boost more than any other Ultra. Obviously, Gogeta hasn't been on it, Vegito's still on it. But then you look at Kaioken, his output won't look like anything crazy. I mean, it's just unfortunate for him. I don't know what really the issue is besides that his team doesn't prioritize him. Like, well, there's teams that don't prioritize, I mean, Dragon Fist Goku, while they do help him with like Tapion, he's not like priority 24 7. It's Ultra Gogeta who's priority on like a movie setup like that, right? So I don't know what this guy's issue is. He just doesn't do enough output. And with that, it's like a mosquito. That's why I could really compare him to. He does damage, it does something, but it takes too long to have like a real effect. And I'll probably have Vegeta snipe out units more than this guy will actually kill out units in most matchups. I mean, I'm assuming at this point, right? 
Uh, stats, again, he has fine arts. Strike, oh, he gets stuff on this, I didn't even know that. Restores on key by 5 pawn activation. Blue card destroys all enemies' blue cards, which is, I mean, obviously for Ultra Gogeta for the sake of that, because he spawned a billion blue cards. Blue card is a quick animation of his own. Third sense plus your damage flick, returns her counts and upon activation. Your seven key by 70 on hit his green card, which he will draw a lot, because per new gauge he gets green card, and he wants to get these green cards to obviously buff his old damage. Restore zone key by 40. Uh, this is actually similar to MUI, where both want green cards to buff their old damage, right? MUI is two green cards to peek out his. This guy is five green cards to peek out his. Third cent damage inflicted, 10 timer counts, and 10% old damage inflicted. Activate five times again, 50% peak there. Then his ultimate can't have 100% peak because 50 50. Uh, here, while it does have blast armor nullification, I believe MUI is the same exact thing where you go through blast and you don't actually get hit by them. It's kind of like a rising rush, right? You go through these blasts that they're throwing at you. You don't get hit by those blasts. You just ignore it. It doesn't exist. So you have Blast Armor Nullification, um, as well as Nullify Endurance on three time accounts of using the ultimate main ability. Gives you Null Cover Change, 30 time accounts, which is very good. He needs that because he combo extends for a long time, so he needs Null Cover Change somewhere in his kit. Source on top of 30%, uh, key by 40, draw the ultimate, and cancel on attribute downgrades and normal conditions. Z ability, we're going to over. Ultra ability, uh, obviously want to loot a slot because he wants to be on the USS. So here, loot a slot it, he'll get his full ultra ability. And then how he does work. Shouldn't really have to touch on this, but I'll just go over the basics. 110% entry, reduced density by 50%, cannot be canceled, 50% security recovery, and then when he does get his gauge, he draws a green card, restores health by 15%, activates seven times, gets strike damage inflicted up to 80%, gets blast damage inflicted to the next blast, and strike up to 80%, gets the next blue card damage inflicted up to 40%, reduces next damage to same by 20% when he does get his gauge. Same thing as uh, Gogeta. I think Vegito actually just has that innately, that extra 20%. And then he gets vanished back up to five times when he does get his gauge. Then when he enters, he gets card draw speed, own key back, minus enemy card draw speed, seals enemy card slot, and uh, seals enemy strike. And that cannot be used. And then when, uh, wait, when this character evades, okay, so when he sidesteps, he gets card draw speed, really destroys one enemy card, inflicts enemy attribute downgrade, minus 50 security recovery, and does have a strike cover change uh, combo into his blue card. With that being said, let us see how Ultra Kyo Ken Goku can do today. First match up against two fusions and is that Dragon Fist? I believe it is Dragon Fist there. Well, Kyle Ken's free at least. That's nice. Hopefully he can actually do something here. No. No. Good stuff so far. Nothing's happened. Great! Got a catch. And now we let Kyle Ken try his best. Reminder he is supported by Whis. And uh, hopefully that means something here. It's not much output, unfortunately. But he does ramp up, technically, in a technical sense. It's not really a full-on ramp up, and great, we got caught. Well, let's go to Whis. He really does stop dragging his combos more or less in their tracks. If he does come in. Okay. Awesome. Now we just continue with Whis here. We go back into Kaioken when possible, and hopefully you just swap like a silly player. And from there, I can just rush you. Don't swap on this though, please. Thank you. Appreciate you. Got card draw speed again. You can see his damage. He's hitting like a little bit of mosquito here, which <laughs> that's not a good. That's not a compliment. Like it's not good to hit like mosquito. You want to hit hard. You want to hit very powerful, boom boom shebang damage. Awesome catch. Thank you, Vegito, for that. Okay. And now I lose a unit. That's kind of how the logic works, usually. You get comboed in a second combo, and your unit does die. Whoever it is, it's probably Whis. Mm-hmm. Shocking. It's almost like I knew what's going to happen. Just did a green card. He hasn't done a blue card yet. Hopefully the logic follows, and there's a blue card. Maybe a second blue card. Who knows, right? No one really knows what's going to happen. No, he has a green card, but he had just done a green card. See what I mean? The logic? Flawless. I swear on everything, every boosted unit gets extra green cards and blue cards just added to their hand. Like, I, I swear on my life, because I've seen it way too many times. But that's not for here. That That's for a different video. Awesome. Caught you out. I actually can't kill you. Great, thank you. Got another blue card? Considering you just did one, I would hope you do. Nice, 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 nice. Ain't that great. It's probably a cow can. I 
Are you gonna pop me in here? I'm swiping up if possible. Thank you. Oh my god, we're doing nothing. We're doing so little. Holy shit. Wait, that's real? We're doing that little too? How much does this ultimate do to a purple unit? A yellow to a purple. We, we should do at least like fucking half, right? All right, we did a fuck ton. Oh my God, Vegito is so tanky then. The yellow one, obviously. Caught you, goodbye. Hopefully we could do the rest uh, the same way. Thank you. Do I still have the cover null? Dude, it's 30 count. I should still have this cover null for the entire rest of this fucking combo. <laughs> like, <laughs> this shit should not drop anywhere. Keep going and going and going. All I really care about is just getting first life out of the way. But if you want to feed me a situation to where I can rush Dragon Fist, I will. Vegeta already popped the main. Hopefully I don't get guessed here. This is like my fifth combo, by the way. Then I rush. Just saying. For comparison's sake. Don't get guessed. Vegito popped me. Vegito could also one combo both my units. I don't know what happens. I, I hope for the best. Um, doesn't really mean much, but yeah, I hope for the best. Oh, you drew a strike? Oh, you had your strikes unsealed. Two counts. That went crazy quack. Uh, quick, not quack. Gotta cover out. Vegeta should be fine. If I get double rushed, I'll be upset. I'll be very pissed, actually. Just, yeah, why would I not? Okay. Nice. 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 I got a lot of green cards. Thank you, Whis. Appreciate that. Yeah, yeah, double rush here, aren't I? That's not gonna kill either way. Just gonna get the fuck out. You're gonna take a lot of damage. And he has more cards in his hand. Exciting, Vegito. That's a mid range blue card. Not the biggest fan of that. Apologize, there's background noise, by the way. It is a hotel, so I would be uh, not shocked. Kaioken, you need to do more. Straight up, you gotta do more here, man. Come on. This is pathetic. Look how low this is. He's a 10 star. He really needs a Zenkai buff? Oh my god. Yeah, that's... I mean, I can't say that's good damage. That's pathetic, right? He's not gonna fucking kill. Oh my god. My god, you actually couldn't? Okay. Okay. I'm gonna get double rushed here, I'm gonna lose. He couldn't kill there? Are you serious? <laughs> oh my god, I just... If I get double rushed here, I'm so upset. Oh. Well, there's a double rush, but good thing I tackled. <laughs> the fact that I almost lost that match because his output was just too low, that's so embarrassing. <laughs> the first match of many. That was pathetic. Hopefully he does better. Reminder, he's an ultra that's... How old is he? He's not even six months old, right? Or he barely is. He should not be older than it. ten months. I, I don't fucking know. Gogeta is not even like a year old. This guy's... We're at DBL 49 right now. He's four months old. Haha. <laughs> okay. Well, yeah. Power. Power. Oh, uh, okay, great, love that. Huh, TV in the background, don't mind it. It takes 10 years to pause. Please! Won't pause, won't pause. Thanks! Very happy about that, guys. That was great. Don't you guys like that? Good. Fun times. Oh my god, you suck. Kyle Ken. Dude, this is negative two damage. What the fuck? Yeah, thank you, MUI. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Heard him sidestep. Let's see how much this blue card does. I know we're tight disadvantage. Trust me, I know. <laughs> it's an ultra, by the way. Ultra. <laughs> Funny ultra. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Why are you drop comboing? What are you doing? You know what you're doing. I want to see the funny ultra do funny ultra numbers. That's all. That's all I'm here for. Thank you, Dragon Fist. I appreciate you. PB? Oh, thanks. Alright, funny ultra. Do funny ultra things, right? Please? Yeah, I understand. Can I just rush you and kill you out? 
Hopefully you don't get a screen card. <laughs> don't get guessed. I feel like this doesn't kill. Headliner team, if I didn't say it. Headliner team. This does not kill. It does kill. Alright, I'm proud of you. I'm proud of you, Kaokan. Genuinely, I am. To wait. Thank you, Weesh, for giving the PB there. Appreciate that. Did this guy DC? No, he didn't. It just popped main ability for no reason there. Okay. Interesting, interesting. Interesting. Let's tap again. That's a weird green card considering it's a long animation, but hey, you do you. You make your mistakes. I don't mind at all. Now, Kaioken, go. And try your best. Please give me blast cards, because that is a strike cover change in the background there. I don't know how long I have the cover null, because I have too many buffs going on. And all strikes in hand. Great. Well, we will go, and go, and go. Weiss, I think it's going to help sort of what's happening there. Maybe again, this output is not it. This output's just not it. It's just not enough. Like, that's an ultra. Like, I can't. I can't stress this more, it's an ultra character, it should be doing, like, nuclear. Even Gogeta, like, entry, he's fine. This guy is not very fine on entry. But hey, the PBs help! They definitely do. And I kill Dragonfist. I should not have to ask that question, it should just happen here. Honestly, again, Dragonfist is not a tank, we know this. So if we don't kill him... Please, Kaioken. Or... You're gonna kill him here, right? You're not just good for farming a rush, right? Surely you kill it here. Oh, you're back. Oh, thank you, Vegeta. Appreciate you for being back. We did that long of a combo, huh? Okay, his Vegito's gonna die now, and now it's all up to Dragon Fist. Well, the match turned on its head from <laughs> not being able to play for a couple seconds there. Now what happens? I'm just gonna blast. Okay, Vanish is gone. Oh, yeah, he gets his gauge. I forget he gets his gauge full when that happens. He has no more cover and all. Unlucky. Rush! Why'd you pop me? Huh? Huh? That doesn't kill. What? Okay. Sure! <sighs> I got way too close though. Well, if you vanish, you lose. I meant by rush, but if I want to rush you... Okay, full HP! Kaioken? <laughs> you really should be able to do this. I understand no support, but an ultra should not mean support. It's my very plain logic there. Okay, we got a green card. We use all our vanish backs, by the way. And we're still going. We can't kill Dragon Fist. Dude, there's no way we don't kill. For real? Really? I mean, dude. <gasps> the proof is in the pudding. Uh, thank you, Dragonfist, for guessing my rush. Appreciate you, bestie. I thought I sidestepped. Guess not. Now I'm about to be in a 50-50 where I get fucked up because of a rising rush. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And he healed as well. Yep. We're really fucked here. Oh, he's gonna rush me. Now I'm in a 50-50. Great. Awesome. Sublime. No idea. He did a green card recently. The game has no idea what it spawns. And it's blast. <sighs> okay. <laughs> At least he's just showing his reality. He's not very good. Pop this. He's doing something. Some stupid shit's happening. And... Oh, okay. It's a blast. A strike. I have blast. I win. Yeah, his damage is not it. He's supported by Whis. He has green card spawning by Whis, which he really wants because it gives a lot of stop times, a lot of uh, gauges and stuff. Nah. Nah. No shot. This is not it. This is really bad. It's not like something down horrendous where he's like dog shit, but... You see the output. It's like a mosquito. It's not doing much. Over time, sure, but like, what's the likeliness that I'm gonna get such good situations like I did here? It's just not likely enough. You have much better situationalness, situationalness for yourself 
with the other two Ultras. And I have to compare him to the Ultras because he is an Ultra. He's newer than Gogeta. And he's not even top 10. I feel like this is very much showcasing that he easily has fallen off. Um, is this MUI on movies? It is. It is. Interesting. Very uh, interesting. I have not seen this one before, so happy to see. We're spreading out our bands of PvP expertise everywhere. For sure. Great. K Pound's not gonna die. I can't dash forward. Hello! Wow, I, whoa, what? Oh my god, that was so spontaneously random, that lag. Wow, I never seen such a thing. Come on, come be better, be better. It's a fucking fun game, be better, bro, please. For the sake of fucking having some fun. Come on, my god, can't be doing this shit. Can he swap Tapion? No. I think Dragon Fist dies here. Vegeta's actually a good unit, you know, Kaioken. Fell off the wagon. Sad times. Fuck him. Uh, Vegeta, kill. Thanks, Vegeta. Appreciate you. Can always rely on you to actually, you know, beat the shit out of somebody. In a hot main. Fuck it. Why not? Thank you. Appreciate that. Spontaneous lag. Spontaneous forfeit. Hand and hand. Together. The plays. Together. Lovely stuff. Thank you. Uh, Super Saiyans, okay, well, I mean he's free, alright. Awesome, we'll go for another strike, then we'll go to Kaioken, hopefully it just works out. Thank you, am I gonna drop, because I feel like you're gonna swap anyways. I also wouldn't swap when I'm getting comboed to fuck and I'm about to lose my unit, same. Now it's gonna be clash because I did that too late. Yep, sad. Win that, thank you. And now we continue, I assume you swap here, even though you... Could I just swap prior to this? No, you're still not gonna swap. There you go. Figured it was coming eventually. Now we just continue. Again, Kaioken not really doing much output to actual relevant tier units, unfortunately for himself. You would hope for more, but unfortunately it's just not the case. Sad, sad situation. Sidestepped, right? I think I just heard it. Yep. And then I'm gonna pop main. I guess do the ultimate. This is basically a raw ultimate. Not much build up for the green cards. Sure, but again, I'm using an ultra. I should be doing good here, right? Oh, that's good damage, nice, nice ultimate. I don't think it has cut pen on it, but he does have nice ultimate damage. Um, I don't know how I just PV'd you and I apologize. That should not have been PV. Genuinely, it shouldn't have been. But okay, I'll take it. Uh, okay. Wait, what? I sidestepped and it... Huh? Okay. It did the sidestep noise for Vegeta? But he didn't sidestep? I don't know what that means. I mean, it means that I don't catch him. Sure? I, I'm so confused. What just happened? Okay. Whatever. And sidestep. The game wants to drag this match out. Feel free, game. Feel free. I personally don't want to, but you know. It's all up to you. All up to your discretion, Dragon Ball Legends. And he has more cards. Interesting. Interesting. Very interesting. Tackle here. Okay, and then we just let Vegeta go, and combo extend for a year. Why'd that drop combo? I have no idea. Wasn't my intention. There's a lot of unintentional things happening in this match, uh, for sure. Can't confirm that one. 100%. All I'm doing this for is to combo extend and get Kaioken back. I don't actually expect you to let me kill your Vegito here, but if you do, it'll happen right now. Um, 
I didn't draw a card? Are you serious? Really? Wow. What kind of bullshit's that? Tap. Thank you. Let me tap out. Bardock, it's worth getting the rush off. Fuck it. In case he double vanishes and some bullshit like that, just get this rush off. Hopefully, we don't get guessed here. Hopefully. Very hopeful. Of course, we do. Not shocked. Let's try more legends. It's a gamey experience we all ask for, obviously, with that guess. And he did a green card because he thought I couldn't swap. Interesting. Let's go up this blast, get Vegeta building up. I'm not sure if I popped your first life already, actually. I don't think I did. Nope, and I'm not gonna pop your second life because I am not doing enough. Straight up not doing enough damage. Unfortunate, isn't it? He's gonna rush here, probably? Oh, but he went quickly. And... fuck. Okay. Hmm. Sidestepping. Thank you. He had vanished back. Surely you won't want combo me. Surely. You don't have main. Hey, what? Okay, what? Okay. I don't think that was on purpose, but sure, we'll take it. Um, again, we might be winning these matches, but Kaioken's just not hitting hard enough. It's an ultra, dude. I keep saying this because it's true. The ultra needs to hit harder. He's hitting like a mosquito while it goes well over time. The ultimate's the only thing that's really hitting hard, and then everything else just kind of exists. Like, to Bardock, he wasn't even hitting that hard, and it's Super Saiyan Bardock. He's not something actually new, believe it or not. Blue, blue, yellow. Okay. Hope for the best. Oh, okay, sure. Since there's no blast cover change, we go to MU. Not MU. <laughs> Use him one time, I keep thinking about him. Uh, Ultra Kyle Ken. Let him vibe out. Should do okay. Yeah, not bad there. Pop the screen, see what's going on. Not much. All these strikes are not good. Oh, what are you gonna do? Oh boy. Yeah, getting caught is not something you should be doing. Something we did though. Unfortunate. I think I just go to Whis eventually. Just get this combo start to be a little bit reduced because <gasps> this Vegito can combo for fucking ever. Interesting. Tap here. Tap again. Um. Vegito Blue's dead? No, you actually went for that! Interesting. And you have a blue card, uh, of course. And my Dragon Balls are gone. Alrighty. Great stuff, great stuff, great stuff. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Mr. Gogeta. Appreciate that. Let's get this heal. I'm gonna pop main. Nice. Caught you on the sidestep. And we should be fine here. Obviously, if he swaps, I'll just rush because, well, having a unit down will be great for us. No, we know cover change. Hmm. I guess I'll throw the rush here. And sub counts are about down enough, and Vegito can't come back in, obviously. We really sacked off Ultra Gogeta? Why? Are you expecting him to live this? I have no idea. Why? Why is Gogeta in here? Didn't guess me. Great. Why? Why? I don't understand the value of that. Gogeta's far superior to Vegito. I mean, Ultra to LF, obviously. Uh, that was weird. Did not expect that. Can say that much at least. Drop another green card, see what's going on. Thought he attacked me. Why would you? No reason to. And more strikes, great. Yeah, I figured playing the game there would be something that uh, is unique. And double vanish. Awesome. Let's go to Whis, just reduce some stuff. I'm just gonna get my ass beat here, but maybe it could help us out so we don't get our ass beat fully. You won't kill me on this one card. Okay, sure. Uh, I used your Vanish already, so you can't double Vanish here. You'll probably go Vegito Blue, if you can't even swap. Yeah, I'm not gonna kill anybody, don't worry about that. Can't swap. Yeah, I can't even kill that life, huh? Ain't that sad. And now we kill Ultra Vegito, and this guy's in the back foot. Again, I don't know why you sacked off Ultra Vegeta. Instead of a Shido Blue, I, I don't know what the plan was there. And the thing falls! Thank you, appreciate that. Try to fix it while winning this match, don't mind me. Okay, thank you, appreciate that. I'm just gonna go. 
Awesome. Okay. Uh, can I fix this while playing the match? Thank you. Appreciate that. All right. Whis, die. Don't care about you. Literally have no value to me in any sense of the word. I don't know. You're just going to let my Vegeta come back in because you don't want to do the ultimate. Being a little stingy here. You're actually just going to keep going. Okay. Okay. I, I can tell you from experience, this Vegito Blue cannot win this match. Just saying. I mean, I could be wrong. I've been wrong before, but uh, probably one of the best screens in the game. Just don't think this is a spot where he's going to end up losing the match. Uh, again, I'm just thinking out loud. Kaioken did well there. Uh, we finished you off, right? Yeah, Vegito Blue is super paper compared to when he's up against a type of disadvantage or advantage to him unit. Nonetheless, Kaioken, uh, he's looking like Kaioken. It's just, again, with a boost, he would be clobbering with that potential of uh, spamming greens and blue cards and strikes and blasts of these big spam moves where he can farm double rushes very quickly, all these things. But now, he's not clobbering. He's doing well on the blue cards, well on the ultimates, and, well... Not great, I would say. I think over his equips. Oh, we're this far into the video. Fuck it, let's do it now. Um, <laughs> not great on anything else. I mean, it's doable. It's workable as damage. It's not like it's terrible, but it's just it's an ultra. It should be higher. Equip wise, fuck it. We're here. Double blast tech and then health store there. I decide that because heals a lot, so health store makes sense to me. Very logical uh, setting. This one, Strike Defense, Bullshit Damage, Ultimate Damage, Advanced Cage Recovery. And then the first one, which is his Pure here, which is Key Recovery, Strike Defense, and a Pure Blast up to 12%. When Range Type's Bell member, lo and behold, he's a Range Type. Let's continue. Probably one more match to wrap up. The Never Aging, the perfect unit, Puddle. Whoa. Now, Puddle is ideal. Puddle is perfect in every sense of the word. Puddle can never be bad. Puddle is God, actually. So, glad to see Puddle is here. Puddle will never fall off in my book. Ever, ever. I'm being sarcastic, by the way. Please don't believe that. Thank you. I'm not going to waste the gauge here. Let's do this blue card. Cool. Take gauge. Okay. Let's pop a green. I'm going to spawn a green because I have a green card right there. Pop another. Have a rush in hand. A lot of strikes. Awesome. Uh, don't swap. Don't swap again. Thank you, Puddle. Appreciate you for coming in. Doing all the work that you can. The best work ever, obviously. You're Puddle. You can't do anything bad. You're perfect. This is drop combo. And it worked out. Cool. Oh, I guess I'll just go for the strike. You can't swap in time. Interesting to swap there when two combos means rising rush. It's just how the game works. It sucks, but it is. Don't get guessed. I don't think G4 is dead. I know he looks dead. I think he looks because his big cut. He has it still. I think G4 lives this. That'd be very sad. He doesn't live it. Thank fuck for that. Okay. Are you tapping? Yes. Hmm. Oh, that worked. No, yeah, when I do mid ring strikes, I expect them to work a lot. Obviously. Why would it not? Mid-range striking? Ideal. Optimal play. Legends, can you not spawn me only greens and blues? Thank you. I'm a big fan and advocate for uh, other cards in my hand. That's just me. Might be in the minority here, but that's just me. I have green cards. I do not give a shit about any of this damage Puddle can do. Great stuff, Puddle. You're looking great. You're looking like a god tier unit. Let's pop the green cards and heal everything. Okay. Okay. Shocks. Can Kaioken finish off EX Gogeta? I doubt it. He also doesn't have his big cut. Reminder of that. I don't think Kaioken could do anything here, actually. I think he just kind of exists. And hopes to finish somebody off. He doesn't, but he hopes to. <laughs> really can't do that in most scenarios. I mean, he did kill G4, to be fair. But, you know, G4. It's G4. Like, I prefer probably to use... <laughs> I, I mean, nah, I would prefer to use the EX Gogeta. But still, I could say that and half mean it. Okay. Thank you for the PV. And Puddle Boy's gone. Oh. <laughs> Why did I drop? Brain fart. Big one. Okay. Okay, that's fine. Kill my Whis. Sure, have at it. 
Mm-hmm. Minus cargo speed, by the way. Should be done. Nice. Blue card. Get your first life out of the way. Okay. Thank you. Oh, I already killed his first life. I forgot. Whoopsies. Oh, that worked. Cool. Why not? Plays just work randomly when you just do them randomly. Again, did not mean to drop there. Thank you. <laughs> just drop by accident at this point. Let's pop this. He's attacking. And now the match is over. Wow. Should it be over? Kaioken, can you kill this EX Gogeta in three cards here? No hands. Two cards. Two cards. Great stuff. We'll do our match. Fuck it. Why not? Weird team there, but wrap it up. Like clockwork. All right. Well, this guy wants to uh, apparently fold, forfeit, waste time. So here, you can waste my time and uh, 15 counts can go by and then you'll lose the match because you'll forfeit. Overall, though, Ultra Kyle Ken, he's too damn squishy. He does too little output. The situation where he can heal a couple of times is just not enough. It is not helpful enough for him. You're actually just not going to forfeit. You're just going to like sit there. I'm not going to kill him. If you want to waste my time, I'll waste your time. Simple as that, right? But, um, yeah, Kaioken, what he does need is... I mean, he shouldn't need anything. It's too early. He should not need jack shit. What does he need, though? He seems a better team. He doesn't really have a team that helps him, huh? And a more purple down in meta. Like, if he came out during mono purple instead of, um, Ultra Gogeta, who came out, like, a month after, you know, he'd be in a lot better spot, but... The fact that he's out now, okay, this is actually hurting my head that he's doing that, so let me just float backwards. Um, the fact that he's, you know, coming out at a time where there's no purples really relevant, you know, you have a rival go on who could kind of come into matches. Weiss, I guess, sometimes, but Weiss doesn't need to be countered out. We're probably going on also the same thing. He doesn't need to be countered out. It's just that they're so fragile, you don't have to really worry about them. But, like, Vegito, you need to counter out Vegito. Ultra Gogeta, you need to counter out Ultra Gogeta. Like, you need these units to counter out. And this is the one ultra, you don't really need a unit to actually counter out. So, situation for him there. Okay, you want to get LF? Here, you could have got LF. Have fun. You're going to leave the match? You're going to watch the LF. Who cares? Yeah, thank you for wasting my time. Appreciate that. But, uh, Ultra Kaioken just needs a better meta for himself. He needs a better team around him. If this Vegeta were blast based, sure, that would help him out a lot. But again, situations just aren't ideal for him. And his output just lacks when he's not on boost, unfortunate. But it is the fate he has been dealt. Very good baseline kit, very good baseline stuff when you read them on paper, but you actually use them in practice and it's just not that impressive. Well, what do you guys think of Ultra Cow Chem? I'll see you guys in the next one.